Chapter on Can a Janub, a person who has yet to take a bath after the sexual act or wet dream, put his hands in a pot containing water before washing them if they are not polluted with the dirty thing except Janaba? Ibn Umar and Al Bara bin Azib had put their hands in the water without washing them and then they performed ablution. Ibn Umar and Ibn Abbas did not think there was any harm if the water dribbled from the body while taking a bath back in the same container from which the bath of Janaba was taken. Narrated Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, The Prophet, peace be upon him, and I used to take a bath from a single pot of water, and our hands used to go in the pot after each other in turn. Narrated Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, Whenever Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, took a bath of Janaba, he washed his hands first. Narrated Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, the Prophet, peace be upon him, and I used to take a bath from the single pot of water after Janaba. Narrated Anas bin Malik, may Allah be pleased with him, the Prophet, peace be upon him, and one of his wives used to take a bath from a single pot of water. Shubha added to Anas's statement, after the Janaba. <laughs>